2016, a group of medical professionals and outreach workers came together to discuss a glaring community problem. People without homes in their community were going without medical care, so they set up a monthly foot care clinic to provide this much needed care. Then, volunteers took to the streets using the innovative street medicine approach. Street medicine embodies going to the people. We hit the streets, park, encampments, and more to give out supplies and provide basic medical care. Today, we still use street medicine, but we also host clinics at homeless shelters and have full-time case managers dedicated to helping those who have no homes get into permanent housing. For the last year, we have also been entrusted by the city to run the first city-sanctioned campground, which is made up of 29 8x8 shelters. Through this project, we have provided dozens of people with temporary shelter and gotten many into permanent housing. Through these services, we bridge gaps in health care and housing equity. In the wake of the pandemic, emergency funding ceases as we transition out of the state of emergency, but homelessness has only increased and the opioid crisis rages on and is having a bigger impact on the people we serve now more than ever. People without homes are the most vulnerable people in our communities. They are disproportionately people of color in the LGBTQ plus community and live with a serious mental illness. They are also treated as subhuman by their own community ignored and seen as lazy, deviant, a blight, rather than human beings who just need help. Currently, we fund a full-time nurse on staff, but it is our dreams to have two full-time nurses and a medical doctor so this population can get the medical care they need and that everyone's there.